Hi, it's Mr. Jones, and I'm going to do a reading about Dr. Martin Luther King, who was a real uh, inspirational uh, person in American history. Stood up a lot for uh, black rights and, and shaped the, the America that we see today. Uh, a few things come from it. It talks a little bit about the Nobel Peace Prize. Uh, that was an award given to someone who was really inspirational and actually made a real difference. Uh, civil rights comes up, and that's to, to, to do with uh, talking about equal opportunities for all. Uh, it mentions that his inspiring speech in Washington, D.C., which is the capital of America. So I will start the reading now. Dr. Martin Luther King Jr., Changing America by Barbara Radner, 2005. Dr. Martin Luther King, 1929 to 1968, was a Baptist minister and the leader of the African-American civil rights movement. This article shares key details about Dr. King's life and accomplishments including his belief in equality and non-violence. As you read, take notes on the problems that African-Americans faced during the 1950s and 60s, and the strategies that Dr. King used to create social change. Dr. Martin Luther King Jr. was a great leader. He inspired many people. He brought about changes that are important to everyone in the United States. In fact, he is known around the world. He was the youngest person to win the Nobel Peace Prize. That is that is a prize given to a person who is important to the world. It is a peace prize. He wanted people to change things peacefully. He thought that violence only led to more problems. Dr. King used a way of changing things called non-violent protest. He saw that people were not treated fairly. He protested for civil rights. When he led marches, people were angry, but he was determined. Even though people shouted at him, he kept marching. People who had been afraid to protest before were encouraged. They joined him. He was able to give them confidence. Together they would overcome. Soon thousands of people were with him. He was changing America. He organised boycotts. A boycott means that people do not buy something or shop at a store or use a service. The boycott he led was the Montgomery bus boycott. Before that boycott in 1955, African Americans could not ride in the front of a bus. They had to sit or stand in the back even if there were seats in the front only whites could have could have those front seats it took months but they won they got the right to sit anywhere in the bus dr king influenced many people he reached them with his books and speeches he gave a very inspiring speech in washington dc people call it i have a dream speech in it he told about what he had seen the changes that had happened and what would happen in the future Today, the United States celebrates life with a special holiday every year. On that day, people remember what he accomplished. They think about how he has made a difference to everyone in America. Now we're going to restart the video and undertake choral reading along with me. Thank you.